<laughs> oh man. <laughs> my, my name is James Creighton. I'm with Heron Gate Barn Theater. I'm an actor here. And we're here to interview Jared Doyle from Light of Day Studios. He's the founder of Light of Day Studios. We have a special day allocated on May 28th where all the proceeds from the show at Herringate here will go to the studio. So, Jared, tell us a little bit about Light of Day. Okay, Light of Day Studio is a free recording studio for young people. The concept is that they do a few hours of community service and help other people and then we record them free and the real idea here behind the studio is to try and get young people to feel good about community service and get involved in music instead of getting involved in other things unfortunately such as gangs or, or be it drugs or whatever give kids something to do and they'll be okay and there's lots of sports events and things like that but then there's kids that also are, are more artistically inclined and uh, the Light of Day studio is a perfect fit for them and winning the hearts and minds of youth and keeping them on the right track is what we're about. Well, that sounds like a great project, Jared. Uh, why don't we take a look inside Herringate and let's see what they have to offer. Yeah, now Herringate, it's beautiful. Why I'm here too is because it actually is a beautiful dinner and a great play. It's incredibly good, good entertainment, uh, really, really good dollar value for, for what you can get out here. And as you can see, it's beautiful out here. We hear birds chirping. It's a uh, flock it's, of ducks live on site. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And uh, and it really, really is a great dollar value. So anyone that's buying tickets for this event, you're going to have a great time. Uh, and it's just that Herringate has been just so kind to give us all the proceeds. So it's a win-win situation once again. You know, oh, that sounds great. So let's check it let's out. Let's have a look. All right. Okay, so here we are in the dining area of Herringate Barn Theatre. You can see the atmosphere is lovely. The guests are just arriving now as we speak. Um, it's been around for about 33 years. You can tell the stalls are intact. It's labeled with the cows' names. Um, there's a wonderful uh, salad bar with a multitude of selections. Um, the entrees uh, are usually quite plentiful, and you go up and uh, you get service from a buffet style at the front. Also, there's there's always complimentary tea and uh, coffee. There's also a uh, fully stocked bar for those who like to uh, partic participate with liquor consumption. And it's, it's a really a, a lovely place to be. But and, and, and it's so, it really is such a genuine place, yet it's so modern too. Very, very nice and clean and comfortable, and uh, yet it's a barn, and, and there's no place like this anywhere, no. really, that, that I can even think of, you know? No, I've never seen anything like this before anywhere. And yet, when you're upstairs, wow, it's very much a, in a barn, but a modern theater, very comfortable seating, and always a great place. And we'll take a look up there. Yeah. Too bad we don't have smell-o-vision, by the way. Ah, uh, it's true. Man, if you were here right now, you could the smell all, the, the, all of the food. It just smells fantastic. The meal is great. You know, and again, the dollar value of, of purchasing these tickets uh, for May They're very modestly priced. Yeah, for May 28th, uh, for that, that that's a Thursday evening. It's going to be fantastic. Uh, you're going to have a great time, a great meal. But again, all the proceeds go towards helping youth. And uh, again, we got to help. You know, really thank the Heron Gate Barn Theater for being so helpful uh, and supportive of us. That really is a unique dining and theater experience. You can see the buffet being served now. Look at that beautiful gravy being poured on top of that roast beef. Yeah, there's several entrees, like I said. And look at the desserts. Aren't they just delectable? Look at that. And again, this is a buffet, so you can eat all you want. And, and all of those desserts are, are diet-free, right? Oh, absolutely. Especially the pecan pie. Yeah. My favorite. <laughs> um, there's a multitude of entrees available. Uh, fresh salad, uh, wonderful minestrone soup. Okay. Hi. <laughs> Welcome to Herringate Barn Theatre. Did you enjoy the dinner? Oh, it was way terrific. And how was the oh show? Oh my God, she's, <laughs> she is a natural, I tell you, and they just walked in. <laughs> so perhaps, Jerry, we could take a look at the theater. <laughs> theater. Here you see that we really are in some beautiful farmland. That's uh, Durham farmland out there. It's beautiful. It is so nice and refreshing to, to just be out in the country. And yet, we are in a very modern theater. Even though it's a barn, it's got an incredible amount of history to it. Uh, technically, uh, some of the best equipment, best lighting uh, is really here. Yeah, and this is where all the excitement occurs. Behind me, you can see the stage. Uh, the seating is very comfortable. There are no bad seats. 
That's the beauty of this, regardless of uh, size and shape. They, they actually really, yeah, thank you very much for pointing out size and shape, thanks. They are comfortable seats and there are no bad seats. It's so close here. Yeah. And uh, sometimes if you get lost into the play, you know, you're right up there. You feel like you're right up there in someone's living room or whatever, listening to the story happen. And it's always so much fun, you know? It's a great experience. Yeah. As fate would have it, we have two of the actors performing in the upcoming May 28th show. Perhaps you could introduce yourselves and tell us a little bit about the show. Oh, sure, me first. Absolutely. My name is Margaret St. John Francis, and I play Mrs. Griffin, who's having a little trouble with her husband, as usual. And I play the husband, Mr. Griffin. My name is Paul Francis. And the show is called My Husband's Wild Desires. Almost drove me mad. Yes, and don't we all know about that, ladies? <laughs> and we will see you on the 28th. <laughs> yes, you'll see plenty of me. Oh, dear. Really? Hmm. Oh. So, Jared, tell me, what do you think of the meal? Great talk. Eating. I keep dozing off when she says, uh, even my butt fell asleep. I said, yes, I could hear it snoring. <laughs> we ain't got a barrel of money. Maybe we're ragging at what did you think of the show? Did you have a good time, everyone? Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Wave, say hello. Did you have a good time? Oh, by the way, if you're with someone you shouldn't be with, let us know. You know, just, just in case you're, you know, you're accidentally with your husband or your wife or whatever, you know. You just have a good time. Yeah. That's great. What did you think of dinner? Was dinner good? Good. Yeah. Yeah. I, I love Bessie the most. That was so tasty, Bessie. Yeah. Wave now, everyone. Do the do the Queen's wave. No, no, no. Watch. It's done like this. My mom taught me. I have no idea. Mom taught me like this. Did you? Yeah. I saw Prince Charles in Edinburgh. He just waved his ears. I thought it was a cat. So you should have a good time, everyone? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You forgot the jacket. Did you enjoy the dinner? Oh, yeah. yeah. Awesome. Excellent. Well, there you have it. A tour of Harrogate Barn Theatre. What did you think, Jared? Oh, always a great time. Always a great play. Always incredibly good food. And definitely the best dollar value. But keep in mind, May 28th, all of the proceeds are going to a really, really good cause to help the community, to help youth, to do something positive. So thank you so much to Herring Gate Barn Theatre. And I'm going to thank you ahead of time for purchasing the tickets and coming to our dinner on May 28th. May 28th, be here at Herring Gate Barn Theatre for Light of Studios. It's called Light of Day. Sorry. He's new. I'm sorry. All right, come on. <laughs> Thank you.